A very good morning. You're watching New Vision TV News around Uganda. I am Rathina Sidi and here we look at stories making headlines across the country. We start in Kamuli district. Now the police has indefinitely suspended Kamuli Muslims from accessing a yet to be compelled Malt Billion Mosque. They cited security concerns after a scuffle among Muslims, which left one dead and many others injured. The 1,000-seater mosque is founded by al Stikwama, international Muslim organization from the Middle East. On October 20th, Awan Awusi Shaban Mukembo was reportedly hit on the head with a studded piece of wood during a scuffle between two Muslim fractions affiliated to Chivuli and Old Kampala. The police spokesperson for Soga North Subregion, Michael Kasada, confirmed the death of Mukembo and noted the disagreements between the two groups in calmly dated years back. And in Gulu District, the State Minister for Youth, Florence Nachuala, has urged the youth in Noya, Amuru, and Gulu District to acquire vocation skills to break the vicious cycle of poverty. She made the call while awarding certificates to the youth of Acholi subregion who are trained in hairdressing, construction, and mechanical works. Speaking at the annual youth conference and trade show organized by Save the Children in Gulu, Nachuala said the government had finally finalized with the Youth Livelihood Program, the Youth Venture Capital Fund, and the Women Entrepreneurship Program. The minister asked the youth to organize themselves in groups to be able to access the money. The Gulu Resident District Commissioner Santos Okot Lapolo advised the youth from Noya, Amur, and Gulu to shun lessons and stay normally upright to be future leaders. We move on to Katakwi district where locals in Wera village have arrested a witch doctor and two others over stealing a sheep. They allegedly stole the sheep to perform rituals. The suspects are Michael Osenye, Simon Orien and Richard Amadi, the witch doctor. Well brought or caught the area LC chairman confirmed the arrest noting that a trio stole the sheep belonging to Michael Okirol, the brother to one of the suspects Osenye and slaughtered it. He said the suspects were to be taken to Katakwi Central Police Station for their safety and legal action to be taken. Finally, in Bukedia District celebrations marred residents of Kachumbala in Bukedia District when a non-profit organization for overseas development handed over a maternity ward worth 517 million shillings to the district authorities. Ian Flower, the managing director for engineers for overseas development, says that the new facility has new delivery suits with the state-of-the-art equipment. Kachumbala Health Center 3 was built in 19. 50 and the old maternity was able to accommodate three women but with the new facility 10 women will be attended to instantly. Kachumbala serves over 60,000 people and on a daily the Incha Charles Osekenye says they deliver 15 women but they have been facing lack of space in the old maternity. Vision Group is spearheading a campaign against HIV AIDS. New Vision TV will be highlighting some of the stories and such. We are winning the battle together. However, for more news updates and other programs here on New Vision TV, visit our website www.newvision.co.ug. I am Ruth Naseje.